Hey everybody, so it's Friday. I uh, went by this one dumpster and I saw these uh, filing cabinets sticking out. So I had to go dumpster diving, but I didn't have the camera. So I just figured I'd show you what I was saving out of this load and what I, uh, I'm gonna go take to the scrapyard. I was really happy with the jigsaw. Of course it's stuck. There's a, I got a jigsaw, 10 inch, or bandsaw, it's a bandsaw, I'm sorry. Uh, and I think these are worth money. Uh, Ionic Breeze 3.0. Uh, I think there's like four or five of these in here. I'm gonna try those online, just cause I know that they work. They were all wrapped up real nice. I, uh, of course they're covered with crap right now but there's another that's two ionic breezes anything in a working condition when you're picking it from the trash like uh, it's always worth taking to the market or selling it online I have sold ionic breezes before I think the last one I got uh, 50 bucks for um, online, but that, that was several years ago. I just have to check to see if the Ionic Breeze is outdated or if it's still selling. I'm pretty sure it still sells just because people with uh, lung problems, that's what they always seem to use. I forget how many I pulled out of the trash here or out of that dumpster. Here's three. It's like Grab the next one. Four. And last but not least, there's a fifth right here. There's a bunch of wire in here for, uh, so I got five ionic breezes. I just have to clean them up just a hair, but they are uh, pretty minty for trash. I did find this, uh, huge extension cord um, and I got this guy uh, it looks like a subwoofer um, bazooka I don't know how to say it bazooka maybe it's a bazooka subwoofer um, I'm pretty sure these are uh, these are junk Believe it or not, these sell very well though at the market, <laughs> especially when they have the little metal part. Um, all right, that's these were the things that I thought were amazing out of the dumpster. I'm on the way to the scrapyard now. Um, all right, see you guys there. As Naz is here, he just found uh, out of the scrap load something he could use. Uh, definitely a fire pit. <laughs> fire pit top top. <laughs> Um, Use it as a bottom, though. Li literally, wasn't I only gone for like 15 minutes and came back? But I'm pretty sure it's a um, house liquidation or whatever it's called, the uh, foreclosure. That's it. Yeah. But definitely, ionic breezes. Look them up. All right, scrapyard. <laughs> so I'm at the scrapyard. My goal today. 67 hopefully uh fifty dollars we'll see though probably gonna be like eh, right around there with the load we have yep. there's definitely a lot of action happening over over on that side with all the machinery moving but i don't know we'll find out shortly 6720 pounds is what i weigh well the mountain's pretty high We'll, uh, we'll see how we do. I, uh, I know I'm going to do well this weekend with all that uh, silver plate I have. So this, is, this was just a bonus today. I'm going to put you guys on that time lapse as I unload this.
So I made it back. Um, I decided to pull out my two boxes of wire uh, that I saved. I'm hoping last time uh, they quoted me 50 cents and paid me uh, 40 cents. So I'm going to see if I can uh, make sure I get the 50 cents this time. Uh, but we'll see. Uh, I'm trying to get to that $100 mark today. So 42, I need to have $68 in wire. I have two trash cans and some stuff on the truck. So we'll, uh, we'll see how we do. Uh, all right, heading over to the scrapyard. So we made it over to go drop uh, our wire over at the scrapyard. I guess that was a container of uh, metal that just got dropped off. I definitely got a lot of room out of that. Or they moved a lot of stuff. So we'll see how we do. I gotta go get a container. So I'm here at the metal room. Doesn't look good. Looks like we're only gonna get, what, 25 bucks for all this? If we're lucky? Oh, so sad. Yeah, they, uh, their buyer stopped buying uh, everything with a plug. So, here's some cast aluminum. The lady's actually sellable. But, uh, it's kind of sad. But I guess that's the way, I knew everything was going down and even the computer wire that I got a dollar a pound for is now uh, only 50 cents. So it'll be, uh, it'll be interesting what, uh, that's a lot of copper. Be interesting what, uh, I guess that's their number one. What happens with the price? He said, even if I cut. Hey, it's Dan. How you doing, Dan? Uh, thank you. What, what did you do? Get, get rid of your wire? I got rid of wire and crap and scrap and jack. I, I, I should have noticed the truck there. You didn't notice the truck? No, I didn't. But Dan is the guy I do cleanouts with every once in a while. So. We find amazing things. Tell Re Dave. If you guys remember, he's the one where I found the American flag at his, at his estate sale. So I'll let everybody know when his next estate you sale is. That's pretty cool. It's all Dan. He, uh, we're good. Thank you. So I should have should saved my uh, my wire, but I really didn't want to store that low grade stuff. I have so much of the the higher grade. I'll, I'll have to show you guys my my hoard one day. Um, but it was pretty sad. Only twenty four dollars for two cans of wire. Um, it should have been seventy bucks. It's about fifty cents off of what it was. So I'm. Uh, I don't know. I was fairly sad about it, but it did uh, free up some room at the at the house. Um, all right, I'll uh, I gotta go load up for the market. I'll see everybody tomorrow. Uh, probably gonna go shopping at uh, Lamberville. Um, thank you again for uh, watching, and see everybody later. Peace. I don't know. For anybody who was wondering. Um, I did ask if I cut the plugs off, would I have gotten a better price? He said right now they're paying the same, same, uh, for plugs and plug, like with plugs and without plugs. Uh, their, their buyer stopped buying, uh, wire, uh, this month for some reason they said, so it went down to 25 cents. Um, but I took my, uh, money from the wire and I bought, uh, I can't get it out, but I bought two uh, more bags of silver plate from Goodwill for 20 bucks for uh, to scrap this Sunday. Hopefully, uh, I have over, I think I have over 100 pounds, but I'm hoping for around 150 pounds. We'll see. Uh, we'll find out on Sunday.